flavor. All right, so we're here on the set of Shortland Street with the glorious Hunter. How are we? I'm very well, thanks. Now, you have had the most eventful, I think, um, storyline on Shortland Street. You've been stabbed with a needle. Yeah, you, that, don't do, yeah. you don't do it boring, do you? You do it no, properly. No, either, you know, do it full on or nothing. Did that hurt? Uh, <laughs> it hurt for Hunter, but uh, not, not for me. No, they used a special trick thing that sort of folded away. Ah, the old like the like the old knife that you stab so with it disappears. Sword trick, you know. Did you did you get the the bastard back that stabbed you? Uh, I tripped him up in the car park. Yes. Yeah. After, after they called cuts. The so car. you have had a lot of, as we say, quite oh. wiggy storylines. Do you find those fun or do you find those tiring? Oh, I find them really really fun, and this is a great thing with working on a, on a on a soap as such is that you know the stuff that you get is so full on and so dramatic that it's great as an actor to sink your teeth into that and and play with it. Yeah. And does it make real life sort of boring though? Uh, no, my real life's quite eventful anyway. So ah, I hear what you say. <laughs> what happens in your real life then that oh. makes it so eventful? Yeah, <laughs> I can't say. Well, you can. It's just us and the camera. <laughs> and and all, the, all the people watching. You're watching, yeah, yeah, just us. Um, yeah, no, nah, no, nah, I'll, I'll, I'll leave that personal. So what is your acting background? I mean, have you been wanting to be on Shortland Street for quite a while? Yeah, um, it's it's really, it's it's quite a funny journey actually coming onto the show and looking um, from the inside out. I think as an actor, I mean, I've been acting since I was a young kid doing, um, I think my brother actually did a commercial with you many, many years ago or, or was in um, that skits program with you many, many what was your years, name? years ago. Heath, he was a young, young little kid but in any way oh, yeah. um oh and he had to send me rug, off rugby, yeah, yeah. No, no. yeah. Was, that, that was that heath that was oh, my brother my God. <laughs> oh you guys have to pash go go <laughs> yeah, yeah and, and so growing up as an actor in new zealand i think everyone sort of um tends to knock the show and I mean, I put my hand up. I, I used to. I never used to watch it, but I used to have you know all these comments. Oh, I'm not going to be on Shortland Street because I'm yeah. too busy on my Hollywood <laughs> movies. This, you know, then, then when you're here and you see the work that goes <laughs> into it, and um, and the, the great job that everyone does, it's it's yeah, it's fantastic. But they also say it's an amazing training ground, and people like you know, say Tim Morrison said that mm -hmm. what they're doing here, it's it's the same quality as when you go over in Hollywood. So is that your plan? Yeah. I, um, Definitely, I spoke to Tim when he came back. God, he's a character, that guy, isn't he? Yeah. Yeah, uh, uh, yeah. He's pretty much. He always knows his lines. Always well, knows them. Well, We're yes. Perfect. He knows them when they're stuck to the back of an extra. <laughs> yeah. Um, <laughs> he's got the fun. not going to hate that. He goes. I he love goes, that. He goes. Uh, come here, will you? Come here. Sticks the lines, the page on the back of someone's back. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, sort of, <laughs> does, uh, yeah action. Does the thing, and then <laughs> does it, he looks over. So, Dr. Warner, how's it going? You know, <laughs> and he's reading off someone's back. <laughs> That's the best acting in the world. Marlon Brando. Yeah. The Mary version. Yeah. And no. so that is you. You would like to go to Hollywood? I'd love to. Yeah, I spoke to him. He, um, he, had, he had quite a lot to say about Hollywood and LA and working over there. And he was very, very helpful. And I've um, spoken to a couple of other guys, actually, Martin Henderson and Carl Urban. Um, they were really nice and gave me their time. And But the funny thing is, is that it's a real personal journey. So you just got to do it yourself and see what happens, really. So do you have a sort of a plan, or are you sort of set here for now? Um, I, well, my contract is coming up, so <laughs> <laughs> um, who knows? Everyone send an email, going, he must stay, we must <laughs> keep hunting. That email now, keep the man. <laughs> Basically, while you are here, everyone's loving you, thank you so much for talking to us today, and we look forward to the day when you're in Hollywood and you remember us like you remembered little yeah. brother. Yeah, Heath. Heath, Heath, yeah go Heath! <laughs> Where are you now, Heathy? Yeah. Where are you now, buddy? Oh, <laughs> I can take you now i can tackle you i can do it no, no he wasted me he was just too good he just wasted me flavor